Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ade and if you're new here, thank you for tuning in. Please subscribe down below. Hit the notification bell so you get any update on my new videos. And if you like this video, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you really think and click the like button. Don't forget. Now let's get right into the video. Today is going to be a chit chat, get ready with me kind of video. I'm using a witch hazel facial toner to clean off my face of any dirt. I'll leave all the products in the description section, description box, if that's what it's called. I'm going to use this Zaron Skin Regenerating Hydrating Serum. This is like a moisturizer to me and it's so bomb. Okay, so now my face is all dried up. We're going to start off with our foundation. So I'm going to be using the Blossoms to HD Studio Photogenic Foundation in color 90. It's a little bit red, yeah. Well, what? I have a red on that one. So guys, a lot has been going on in my life, especially in my career. People who know me will know that I had a degree in arts. So recently I've just lost interest in that kind of field, field of work. So I've started transitioning into uh, computer science to an extent, software development, because really, I don't think, like I'm not interested at all in anything arts. If I had someone to advise me when I was younger, yo, I didn't even think I would have wasted my four years in school, you get them. It's also an encouragement to all of you out there that don't like what you're doing right now, you just want to switch up. Hmm? Please don't waste any time. I think I wasted a year or two thinking about this, trying to see ways that which I can move or steps to take. But you guys, please listen. You find the red lights, so you start moving. So I'm going to be using the Flawless, Flawless Ivy Matte Foundation in 600 Honey. I, I normally use this as my concealer because Honestly, I mean, it's full coverage. I think I like the undertone to this. It has a lot of yellow. I think it blends well into the skin as well. So, how many of you guys do your eyebrows before foundation? I don't think, like, a lot of people cannot do their eyebrows when they have foundation on. I don't know why. But if you if you're like that, please leave a comment. I want to know how many people are like that. And if you want to see me go to the worst makeup artist in my in my city. Hmm. Let me see the like button. Smash on it. Let me see. I'll do that video for you guys. I'll be using the Blossom HD high definition setting powder. If you guys want to get these products, you can just check on their Instagram. Oof, that's a lot. I hope we don't look ashy. Okay. 